All right, this is gonna be a lesson for things to do by Alex G. So I'm gonna play through it really quick and then teach it. Here we go, or attempt to at least, because my kids and dogs just came out here, so we'll see. Um, here we go. So that's the song, and then it just repeats. Yeah, good job, babe. I play that. <laughs> playing the drums. Okay, so if you could play a C major chord, which is ring finger on the third fret. The... All right, you guys gotta try to not make so much noise, though. Um, I'm just gonna, I don't know, you gotta bear with me, this is all part of it. So <laughs> third fret of the A string, second fret of the D, open G, and then first fret of the B string. That's a C major. It's the same exact chord, just moved up to the fifth fret of the A string. This is a D chord, some sort of D chord. So what you're playing here, this whole first part is down, up, down, up. And it's, you have this C major chord up here at the fifth fret of the A. So what that was, was, and then you put on the upstroke, you put your pinky down the fifth fret of the B, and then take it off, and then open B, so. And then you move this up from 5-4 on the A and D string up to 7-6 and do the same thing. And then move it up to 10-9 and do the same thing. Back down to 7-6. So that whole part is like this. And then it goes to 3-2 on the A and D, this is a C major 7. And I play these just two finger chords like this, so ring in middle there. This is C major seven. G is just, you move these from the A and D to the third fret of the A, E, second fret of the A. And then leave your middle finger there on the second fret of the A and move your ring finger to the second fret of the D. This is an E minor. And then back to G. So that whole thing was this. dogs um, okay so that was that so the whole first part is this to E minor and then you pull off your first finger there. This part's down up, down up. And it's just C major seven. So G major, F major, E minor, D. And then you can when you get to this D major you can lift off the second fret of the you can either lift off your middle finger or your ring finger over. Or you do. So anyway, um, A minor, C major 7, G, F major, E minor, D, C major 7. And then you can put down the third fret of the high E. Hey, can you just try to make, you can make noise, but you're just being a little crazy. And I'm trying to, people are supposed to listen to this and try to learn this. Um, so when you get to this C major seven, you can do, you can fret the third fret of the high E string or B, because that's part of the E minor pentatonic. 
but don't worry about that. But just know that you can. So anyway, that part was A minor. Seven. And that's the entire song, so I'll try and play it really slow. This part's all down strokes. Down, 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 down. And then this part's down up. C major 7, 3rd fret of the A string, 2nd fret of the D, G, E minor, G, that's the little chord progression there is C, G, E, G, C, C, Oops. and then yeah, A minor, This part is actually probably down up, down up. I'm playing it all weird, but those are the chords. This is A minor, C major seven, G, F major, E minor, D major, G, G or, sorry, not G, C major seven. Margo has it. There's another one here. But that's the whole song. Hopefully I explained that well. Seems like it was really fast. Here, give, give your sister one. Alright, thanks for watching, and yeah, it's an awesome song.